Good morning. It's good to be out here today. It is July. So I gotta get used to seeing that month. It is July 2nd. It is a Friday. It's 524 in the morning. The sky's out. It's beautiful. Not as beautiful as yesterday, but it's probably because I'm doing this recording right now a little bit later than I did yesterday. And there's the mile. And yesterday it was just at the peak time where it's just coming up the horizon and it really just lights up all those top clouds. The ones that are really, really high up there. And it gives it that nice bright red. I do remember hearing that clouds, the color of clouds are a result of dust. Is that right? I don't know. I will have to look that up. But <clears throat> it's a good morning. Uh, some good news, man. I just, well, no, COVID's still going on. But that's what it's all about, right? Finding some good news in amongst the harder times. Uh, COVID cases are going on, getting crazy. Yesterday, according to the uh, news report, in the city, there has been 464 new cases in 24 hours. And that's crazy. That's that's definitely a record. So, not a good bolt in the right direction. <laughs> but it is what it is. And when you like handsy lemons, you make lemonade, right? So trying to find the good and the positive in uh, the mornings, in the days, so that we don't get consumed too much of the negative stuff. So anyway, uh, good news for me is that I stepped on the scale this morning and I finally passed uh, the 260 mark. So I was 259.4. Yesterday I was 260.2. So I finally broke it. I'm so happy about that. Um, it's a nice gauge of motivation. Kind of show that just just sticking to it and yeah I'm, I'm happy I I haven't been this light in the 250s since I looked it up this morning before I went on my run uh, since November uh, 2015 so November of 2015 I was this weight and ever after that I was over 250 something so that's super encouraging and Obviously, the, the, the numbers coming back on the, on the momentum's going down, not up. So back in that day, it went from like 240 to 250 to 260, like really quickly. So it's kind of happy that it's going down now. Um, and yeah, uh, like I said last time, I'm not chasing a number. Um, I'm not chasing a certain weight per se. Chasing more of the stuff, chasing better health, chasing, uh, you know, just being a healthier lifestyle. But one way to gauge that is by your weight. Because it's inevitable that if you do a lot of exercise and um, you kind of stick to it, which is the key point, right? It's not, it's not the crash diet, it's not the diet that you're doing now that you can never sustain or the amount of exercise that you're doing today that you can't sustain. It's all about just being disciplined and uh, sticking to it. Every day, do something. A friend of mine who's a chiropractor he said, motion is lotion. It's a good one. Motion is lotion. So the more your body's active, the more loose your gears are, the more loose your joints are, and you just feel better. Rather than be, if, if I just woke up and I went straight to the computer, then I'd have a bad day. And a friend of mine texted me yesterday, and he said he ran on, went on an early morning run. He, I think he caught the sunrise in fact, which is crazy for him because he never goes out that early. But he texted me in the morning, about six something. He's normally a late riser, about 7:30, 8 o'clock. So he texted me, he said, "Hey, I went on my run." And, 
I drew this little pattern in the Strava app and he showed show me a little pattern. I thought it's funny. Um, so I talked to him a little bit and I told him every second right after I get up, I dread it. I, I mean, as, as much as I know I'm going to get out here, as much as I know I'm, I'm going to get it done, um, those very first like few minutes of the morning, they suck. They suck bad. But I told him what I found, feel so found, right? Feel, I know how you feel. I felt the exact same way. And this is what I found um, is that if, as long as I do it, I know 100% of the time I will say I feel better because I did it this morning. There's never been a time that I pushed myself to get up in the morning and I've woken up and I finished my whole routine, my, my anchor morning anchor and then I'm like oh that wasn't worth it that sucked I never felt like that so that tells me that this action leads to a better feeling for the rest of the morning and into the afternoon and just knowing that is motivation for me to not want my mornings to suck and if I don't want my mornings to suck then I'm gonna be out here do my exercise I'm gonna be out here do my walks do my talks with my camera and yeah so he, he felt motivated a little bit by that and he, he said he might try to do more runs in the morning um, yeah and then that other friend I told you about that asked me for the wheel uh, we had our fresh way Thursdays yesterday and her husband said that that was the best of his week that his wife was kind of in a funk and she didn't have very much structure and she just was very kind of lost and so his best was that she had asked uh, me for that habit tracker and kind of the best is kind of thank you Jesse for uh, setting a good example because if I hadn't done that then that wouldn't have been a solution for her to try and to, do, to get herself out of her rut so that was my best yesterday that was his best yesterday. Um, and yeah, it's all around just good positive vibes that I got from uh, our night last night, pressure in Thursdays. All right, that's about enough. Let's uh, hit our push-ups. That, my friends, was 30 push ups. Hey, we are in July. I just gotta commit to it. <laughs> my strength has gotten weaker, and that's the caveat with all this weight loss telling my weightlifting buddy yesterday I said most of the weight loss has been coming while we haven't been at the gym so I have to take I have to take that into account so just got to realize that you know our muscles are not being used the way that we had trained them to be used for the past uh, I don't know how many months 18 months and now that we're not in the gym I'll, obviously I'm still doing my push-ups I'm still, I'm still out, I'm doing a lot more cardio than I would normally do um, and which is something I hopefully I can keep, keep up but a lot of the weight loss has come in a time period where we haven't been at the gym so I know what that means you know I it is what it is and I realize why but uh, it's really bad if I was gaining weight <laughs> but we're not at the gym that's that'd be even worse so anyway good job Jesse it's July uh, it's the official start of half of the month is over so keep it up love you uh, you're amazing you're great and uh, we'll catch you in the next one Aloha